YouTube, it's your boy JWI Pillard here, and today we have got our usual Sunday vlog. Um, so we're going to be going over four main topics today, uh, beginning with Lethal Gaming. So if you guys don't know, uh, I am now a new member of Lethal Gaming, uh, and Lethal Gaming is a, I'd say like a pub zombie clan. They do have a competitive like sector or whatever you want to call it. They do have a competitive team that they play with that they send to uh, MLG LAN events and all that stuff. Uh, but I'm not a part of it, uh, at least not right now anyways, you know, because, you know, I, I do competitive, so I, I might become a part of it one day. But right now I'm not part of their pub stomping uh, crew. So pretty much what we're going to be doing is Clan Wars mainly, and then we'll just do our regular pub stomping and all that good stuff. Um, so Clan Wars is going to be coming up this Friday and Saturday. I'm pretty pumped for it. Um, they are one of the top two teams, the Zim and, like, Pwn Stars. And uh, so we'll be doing the Diamond Division Clan Wars uh, with them. Uh, I'm pretty, like I said, I'm pretty excited for it. I don't know if I'll be playing on the 360 or the 1. Uh, it really just depends on where they decide to put me, because they could put me on a squad that's on the 360, or they could put me on a squad that's on the 1. Um, like I said, I don't really know. I should know here in the next couple of days. Um, but yeah. Um, other than that, though, um, <coughs> some like recent updates have been going on with my channel, if you guys haven't noticed yet. Uh, the DNA series has been uploaded. Um, so I've been trying to go for these for, I'd say, like, about a week is w uh, the length that I've been like legitimately like you know g getting like legitimate attempts in. Um, so so far within that week we've gotten two DNAs and we've gotten two really close to DNAs and one semi close to a DNA. So two that we've gotten are the ASM one and the a SM uh, the SN six, and then the two really close ones that we've gotten are the AMR nine I went on a twenty six streak with and the uh, KF five I also went on a twenty six streak. Um, so those two should be coming in here soon because I've been getting like better with those two guns. And, you know, they, they should be coming in here pretty soon. I uh, definitely should be expecting those videos here within the next few days or so. Um, and then after that, the one that I got semi-close to was the SAC-3s, the, the dual-wield SMGs. <coughs> I'm sorry. Um, but, yeah, so the SAC-3 dual-wields, um, I went on a 17 with those, which I mean is, like, sort of close. It's, like, it's past the halfway mark, so I, I would deem that to be pretty close, and it's higher than most people would go with those those weapons. Um but yeah, so, so I got to the 17 with those. So those might take, you know, a little bit longer. But th those will definitely be coming in here, uh, you know, not not too long after. And then finally, the Goliath will be the final... Uh, the Goliath, the MP11 will be the final SMG that I that I get. Um, what I want to say about the Goliath is that I unfortunately don't have it yet. So I'm putting off the MP11 to be the last one, just hoping that I'll get the Goliath before I actually end up uh, working on the MP11. Uh, right now I have the Squeaker, which is the other elite variant of the weapon. So, uh, the Squeaker's not that bad of a variant, it's just that the Goliath is, like, it's definitely much better. Uh, the Squeaker's, like, changes that it has to the guns are minus 2 accuracy and uh, plus 2 fire rate, which is basically, like, uh, already having rapid fire on it, except for the attachment's not actually on the gun. So, uh, that that's the stat changes, and then it also gets an automatic red dot uh, placed onto the weapon. So, you know, it's like one of those, like, attachments that is, like, just automatically on the gun, you can't change it or anything. So that's that's the squeaker, and it's like it's all right weapon. Uh, if I were to use it, I'd probably like stick advanced rifling and extended mags on it, and it would just be a close range melt machine. Definitely would not be able to use that thing long range at all because the range on the weapon is not very good, and the accuracy being minus two and the fire rate being up to would just like absolutely like uh, there was no way I would be killing people you know anywhere past mid range um, with that gun. But yeah, that's pretty much it for the DNA series, and then also uh, stuff that's going on the channel has been the uh, <clears throat> the I Want It More series. I Want It More series, if you guys don't know, uh, recently I've been including losses into the series, um, which in my opinion is going to like increase like the enjoyability level of it, um, if, that, if that's even a word. Uh, so basically, like I felt like it was kind of, the series was kind of like spoiled at the beginning because like you already knew that I would win. Um, yeah, especially if it was like, a, like the 1-5 comeback that we had uh, in S and D or whatever against like the rank one or I think it was a two five comeback, but we had it against the rank number one team. You knew that we were gonna win because I said it at the beginning of the video. But now since there's losses included, I'm not saying it at the beginning of the video anymore. I'm just gonna wait and you guys can see who wins or loses. And so like I said, I I just feel like that would that that increases like the the excitement level of the video and like how 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 much like how, how much you enjoy watching it and all that. Um but yeah. Uh, other than that, there is the third topic, which is going to be the shout out for this, uh, vlog. So unfortunately I haven't had time to go around and look at people's channels. Um, <clears throat> the main reason being is just like a time constraint thing. Um, recently I was promoted at my, uh, job. I 
was just a regular part-time employee, but now I'm like a shift manager, so I'm full-time employee now. Um, so pretty much what that means is I went from averaging like 28 to 33-ish hours, 35 would be like the max, to like around like averaging around like 40-ish hours a week. Um, and it can go as high as like 45. This past week was 40 hours. Um, but yeah, so pretty much uh, like it's just it's like put the um, like I it's put me in like a position where I already didn't have a whole lot of time to do what I want to do with this to having even less time. And that sucks because right now I'm, uh, you know, facing the severe issue of uh, shitter net. And basically what that means is my upload speed is extremely slow and it makes it difficult to put videos on YouTube because it could take anywhere from like two and a half hours, like I'd say like two to two and a half hours ish to upload a video. And that's only uploading the five to seven ish minute long videos that I've been uploading recently. Um, so yeah, there's that. And then there's also uh, the fact that editing the videos out can take anywhere from like one and a half to two hours. Which is like you know there there's that you know mandatory thing that I got to do so like the whole making video process could last anywhere from like four to five hours ish, which just sucks in general because it means that I'm also in a time constraint for even getting gameplays at all and since I want to do it every day since I can't stream right now it just it it's hard to get all that together and then still try to find time to you know look at people's channels for the shadow. so I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just gonna have to wait until I move to my new apartment this summer. Um, and I'm going to be moving to that apartment July 15th is the actual move-in date. So that'll be going down. And then I, after that, we'll, I'll be getting better internet. I'll be upgrading to Verizon Files Quantum where I'll have a 75 uh, up and down speeds, which is so much nicer than what I got right now because right now I have like a 9 down and a 3 up, which is ridiculously bad. It's it's totally awful. So um, that'll cut like that'll cut my, my, video upload, my, ugh, my video upload times down to like, you know, I'd say a couple of minutes versus, you know, two hours, which is just insane. Uh, and it, it'll just make everything a lot easier. It'll, it'll, it'll be able to give me some breathing room as far as getting gameplays and being able to check out you guys' channels if you guys want me to for the shout-out video that I do once a month. <clears throat> but yeah, um, other than that, we're going to go over to the last topic. So the PC, uh, the new PC I'm supposed to be getting that's going to be allowing me to stream again, since right now, as you guys know, I can't do that on this computer because OBS is just shits the bed on this computer for some reason now. Like, it's just... I don't know. I, to be honest, I was surprised I could even stream from this computer at all, and for, especially for as long as I did. Some days it would be, you know, because you know, obviously I did 24-hour streams and stuff. But like I said, you know, OBS just it, it just shit the bed, so it it quit out on me. So now I can only stream from my Elgato software, and um, I can do that. The only issue is I don't have a face camera overlay, so it, uh, in my opinion, it kind of makes the stream like lower quality which I don't really like. So I guess that's why I switched over to the whole YouTube and uploading daily thing. And yeah, so, we're, so we've got that going. Um, so like I said, the, the date's going to be pushed back a little bit more because I've got, I'm going on a vacation this summer. Um, and I'm going to be going to Cancun. And the vacation costs, you know, money, of course. And so the money, is, like the money that I'm putting into that is going to be putting the PC back just a little bit. I'll be going on this vacation with like my girlfriend and her parents and her sister and her sister's boyfriend and her sister's friend. So uh, her mom's paying for most of the trip, but I do got to pay for some. So um, that's just going to, like I said, it's just going to put the timeline back a little bit. Originally, I was planning on getting the PC at like right at the beginning of June. But like if like if this happens, then or you know when it ha because it is happening, um, it might be pushed back to like mid June or like early July, you know, which isn't too bad. So it's not like being pushed back like a but like a few months, it's only being pushed back like a couple weeks. And to be honest, since I did get promoted recently, it may not even happen at all. So I may like I may be able to you know pull the money up and in, in in the normal timeline anyways. Uh, so that's just like a maybe scenario, whatever. It might might get pushed back. It might not. We don't know. So we'll see, uh, you know, once the time comes. Um, but yeah, other than that, uh, if you guys don't already know, this is usually just a channel update video, which I've done. Um, if you guys want to go check out my other videos, feel free. They're going to be much more exciting than this, I feel like. Um, so go check out the DNA uh, series. Go check out the I Want It More series. Bunch of really good videos in those. Um, but other than that, if you guys did enjoy this, please leave a like and a sub. Or if you guys enjoy any of my other like actual gameplay videos, leave a like and a sub. Uh, comment what you guys thought in the uh, comment section below. And uh, other than that, peace.